Thanks, Stacia. We're in the cooking corner now. Always happy to have Oklahoma Joe, Oklahoma Joe Davidson here talking about a classic <laughs> in Oklahoma, barbecue bologna, but not everywhere. You can't find this in all states. That's exactly right. I don't know why, because it's one of my favorite things. It takes on pecan smoke so well. But if you travel around on a barbecue pilgrimage, <laughs> Oklahoma is the only place you're going to find it. That, this is fascinating. Why does bologna work so well? All right, so bologna, number one, is that it's often thought of as just a cheap cut of meat, you know. So a lot of people get it and say, well, it's inexpensive to do, but it is delicious. And the thing I love about it is that when we do it, we want it to soak up the most smoke as possible. So mm. what we're going to do is we take and we roll the, the whole chub and we're going to score it and just do that several times in both directions. And that way, Beautiful. you'll see when you cook it, you'll see those scores there. That's just letting more smoke get inside that chub. Then I'm gonna, once I do that, we take it and we cut it down the middle, straight down that way, and then we'll turn it over and do it a quarter that way as well. Where do you buy a, a chub of bologna? I mean, this is just blowing my mind. I, I don't think I've seen the whole thing yet. Yeah, this, and this is, is just this is just half a chub right here. So normally it's twice that length. It weighs wow. 10 pounds, the chub does. Now, oh my goodness. you can go to Reesers and get chubs of bologna. You can get at Walmart or at Sam's Club. So okay. there's a few places you can get that. And the thing that's important is that every bite you want to have smoke flavor into it. So when you do it this way, you'll notice that if you were to take a bite on every corner of this, every every time well, I can I can just try will you it. show that? Show us what that's like, you flavor. know. Flavor. All right. Flavor. Every flavor. piece has got it on there. That's and you know good. what we recommend it with? We make a mm. southern mustard barbecue sauce. And I'm gonna tell you, it is absolutely oh. well if you ever had a barbecue or just a bologna sandwich, sure. Try it with that. And see what you think about it. Okay, because I'm not going to cross contaminate here. I'm going to do it. Yeah, go right quick ahead. Dip. Yeah, yeah, go All right. right ahead. And when you mix it with that, it's it is just so good. And this is something that we're so fond of this that, you know, in the month of May, in celebration of National Barbecue Month, okay. every Monday, we're going to do $1 barbecue bologna sandwiches. Okay. And it, I mean, so, you know what our, our slogan is going to be? Tell me. It's going to be, we're not full of bologna, but you're going to be when you get finished eating our dollar, one dollar barbecue bologna <laughs> sandwiches. So it's going to okay. be a fun celebration of barbecue and everything that's great about it. Barbecue beans, uh, potato salad, you know, a baked potato casserole and yep. barbecue bologna. It's going to be special. Okay, Joe, thank you. And we will be back with more news on 6 at noon. After the break, we do have this live shot, I believe, of the First Baptist Church where students are being picked up after the bomb threats. Uh, several bomb threats were made against Claremore Public Schools. We will be back after the break. It's not 100 degrees yet, but it will be. So get your custom services pre-summer air conditioning checkup now. It's a 26-point tune-up, only costs $89.95. And if your system quits any time during the cooling season, the service is free. Custom services, problem solved. When we found out my wife had dementia issues, I thought I knew what was in front of me, but clearly I didn't. And that's when we ended up at St. Simeon's. The advantage of St. Simeon's, they've got so much more experience than, than anybody else. They not only were the caregiver for my wife, but they became the caregiver for me. Your partner in caring, St. Oklahoma was faced with the largest corruption scandal in U.S. history. Ronald Reagan trusted Gary Richardson as U.S. attorney to help clean up the corruption, which led to the conviction of county commissioners. As governor, you can trust that I will audit every state agents, find the waste, and put an end to corruption. I've done it before, and I will do it again. There's only one man who will fight for the people of Oklahoma as their next governor. Reagan trusted, committed conservative Gary Richardson. Purchase a Four Seasons sunroom for your home this month and we will install it for free. It's our biggest sale of the year. Add space and increase the value of your home by turning your unused patio into an exercise room, a game room for the kids and grandkids, or a place to relax and enjoy the views. Call today and save 25 to 35% off with our once a year free installation sale. See us at TulsaFourSeasons.com or stop by our design center one block east of Willow Nails Mall. 
We'll make you feel right at home. An individual decided to make a U-turn right into me. I was trying to handle it on my own. My dad actually called car and car. They treated me almost like an old friend. Um, very professional, but very relatable. Call or text us today for a free consultation. Looking to stretch that tax refund? Buy your glasses at iMart Express, where you'll spend less on the have-tos and keep more for the want-tos. Two pairs start at just $38.71, and we make them the same day. iMart Express. Right glasses. Right price. Right now. Shoop here for custom services heating and air. Other HVAC companies use outrageous repair estimates and high pressure to get you to buy a new system immediately. Now that's behavior you'll never see from us. That's why we've been in business 38 years and why we can say problem solved. Continuing to follow breaking news now in Claremore where several schools have been evacuated because of bomb threats. And parents are now picking up some of their parents, Emery, or some of their kids. Emery Bryan's live on the scene. Emery. Live at the high school here, Dave, where many of the students have left. The uh, school has been canceled for the rest of the day in light of this bomb threat and evacuation. Uh, we arrived and saw many of the high school students leaving. They had briefly been evacuated over to a community center, then told they could go home uh, for the rest of the day if they had a car. They were told to leave their belongings behind, though. Now, it was a different scene over the junior high where parents were picking up kids, and over at an elementary school where uh, kids were taken off site uh, to another location there. They had to be bussed out, uh, taken to a, a safe place where parents could pick them up. Up there. Information on where to pick up children is on our website and on the Claremore uh, Police Department Facebook page. Uh, as we arrived here for this uh, evacuation at the high school, we talked to a student about the scene when they were told uh, what they uh, what they were told by school authorities. Clear that we just had to evacuate. We had to leave all our backpacks inside when we had to get away from the school as far as possible. Mm. And so uh, school has been canceled for the rest of the day. We think we'll have a briefing here in just a few minutes from uh, Claremore Police, and we'll carry that live on air. On the scene on the story in Claremore, Emory Bryan, News on 6. We appreciate that, Emory. We do have more breaking news we want to tell you about here. Highway 11, a crash has closed the westbound lanes at Pine, so you will want to avoid that area for a while. Again, we will carry that Claremore Police News Conference on TV. Shopping for flooring? Whether it's carpet, tile, or hardwood flooring, choose Four House Design Center. Four House Design Center, quality flooring, customer focused. Fourhouse.com. All signs begin with all signs. From commercial property to an entire building's identity, a key element for lasting impressions, providing the perfect solution at your business, school, or property. All signs, your sign solution company. Hi, I'm Steve Largent. Are you putting off getting hearing aids because you're afraid people will see them? I'm still fairly young and I'm going, I don't want to, you know, everyone to see that I have a hearing aid. I wore them several months at work and finally just said, have, have you noticed my hearing aids? And they said, no, not at all. For a limited time, ClearTone is letting everyone try invisible hearing aids for free. If you don't call ClearTone, you don't know what you're missing. It's the half-off Spring Into Fun sale here at Galaxy Home Recreation. Through this Sunday only, we're taking up to half-off pools, above ground, semi-in-ground, and fully in-ground, all with free installation. Up to half-off refreshing jacuzzi hot tubs from $29.99. Up to half-off hundreds of stylish patio collections. And up to half-off therapeutic swim spas. It's the half-off Spring Into Fun sale through Sunday only here at Galaxy Home Recreation. Looking for vision care during retirement? Take a second look. Ready, Daddy? When it matters most. Thank you, VSP. VSP Individual Vision Plans offers vision coverage you can buy on your own. Because retirement means life's most important moments are yet to be seen. Go to VSPDirect.com to see better. For life, for less. The difference that uh, Town & Country has made in my child's life is profound. I really attribute a lot of his growth to the staff and the families that work together to create a really safe and accepting learning environment. I'm at Town & Country and I feel like I'm not in a school, I feel like I'm in like a learning world. It's just really great for me and that's like the best school ever. 
Read more about us online at tncschool.org or call today to schedule a tour. Every roofing company can say they're the best, but what sets them apart? At Green Phoenix, we're different because the focus is on you. I oversee all projects from inspection, insurance claims, and installation. Our company is fully insured and licensed. Our trained team will always install the best leading products. This is why our customer reviews reflect our commitment to you. Let our family show you the Green Phoenix difference. When hail falls, remember to call. You Build It is hosting a free seminar. Seating is limited, so reserve your spot today. Visit us at youbuildit.com. Your home's in your hands. You build it. Shopping for flooring? Whether it's carpet, tile, or hardwood flooring, choose Four House Design Center. Four House Design Center. Quality flooring, customer focused. Fourhouse.com. Call Airco Service today for all your heating, cooling, electric, and plumbing. From News on 6, this is Breaking News. We return now to Claremore as Claremore police are preparing to hold a news conference after vague bomb threats were made against Claremore Public Schools. We are waiting for the start of that news conference now again with Claremore police. And this is video of some of the pickup locations where students were evacuated and then we're, we're taken to pickup locations where parents can pick their children up. We have a list, by the way, of those pickup locations on our News on 6 app, on newson6.com. It's on my Facebook page, it's on social media as well. There's a, a brief list of it, Northeast Technology Center. You can see the list goes on. But let's take you now to, I believe, the Claremore Police are ready to speak here in this news conference about the bomb threats that were made against Claremore Public Schools today that uh, necessitated a large police response. Okay, come on up, guys. Deputy Chief. Are you ready? Introduce ourselves. Stan Brown, City of Claremore, Chief of Police. Jamie Brace, Claremore Public Schools Information Officer. Steve Cox, Deputy Chief, City of Claremore. Today at 10.44 a.m., the Claremore Public Schools at the high school received a anonymous and as of yet unconfirmed bomb threat uh, to that campus and uh, some other locations that involve school campuses. The school started a response and notified our, S our school resource officer who then contacted us here at the PD and we started a response protocol as well. Keeping in mind in light of all the recent events, the most important thing for us to do today is to ensure that our kids are kept safe. Uh, part of the response protocol was to initially just to get everyone as safe and lock things down where nobody got to get themselves in further danger or harm. And then we started a plan to evacuate students out to safe locations and then to pick up points. We are now at that stage in the game where we will advise students and parents of pickup locations for their students. We'll announce that shortly. But I first want to say that it is my duty and goal as the Chief of Police of the City of Claremore and our staff to ensure that kids are kept safe in, in their homes, in the city, and at, at our schools. I want to also commend the Claremore Public Schools and their administration and their staff for taking necessary precautions to ensure that in these chaotic moments of one, one uh, situation like this initially develops, they took the initial steps to ensure that everyone's safety was paramount. Uh, as you can understand, there's a lot of chaos and confusion when something like this comes in. Uh, they done a really good job of ensuring that your, your students were kept safe. I also want to let people know that this is a criminal offense. Uh, we're going to do what we can within our power to ensure that this person is, uh, is found and brought to justice. Um, you know, we simply cannot tolerate these threats on our students and on our facilities and on our citizens. 
uh, and we, we can't tolerate this disruption to the learning environment of our students. So we're going to ensure as police officers and the Claremore Police that we do what we can to locate this person that filed this threat. Meantime, we're out doing what we do um, inside the schools. We have now started to go through the school buildings themselves and render those facilities safe uh, via technology and use of canines to detect uh, any, any possible threat that might be there, i.e. a bomb or other device. Again, I want to caution parents that it's out of an abundance of caution that we've taken these measures. This is, uh, I won't say it's an unconfirmed report, but it's unsubstantiated as of yet. So b abundance of caution, we have uh, taken a lot of measures. It's been distracting for the students from their learning environment. It's been disruptive to the parents. I know as a parent, if you receive that phone call, your primary